run faster than the new recruit recruits at the academy. He can save 2.3 seconds with less hair on his legs and his head shot. <laughs> <laughs> and something else y'all know about this guy. He also teaches how to go muddy. On Barry's return from Israel, we noticed while unloading our car, the front yard was all tore up. Oh, no. Jeff was in Atlanta at the time and thought someone had to initially demolish their front yard. Mentioned this to Barry. We said, Someone tore up your yard. Pretty bad. She said, mm, It was Jeff. He got the riding lawnmower out and, <laughs> and the riding lawnmower out and, and got stuck trying to mow the yard during a rainstorm. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, then the mud, when he was mowing the rain, and he had to pull it out with his jeep. He tore up half an acre. And uh, his tractor and his mower will never be the same. <laughs> <laughs> the tractor, True. I could see it was John Deere, but usually the tractors are all green, and this thing was completely brown. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, oh, this is so funny. I, thought I would bring this attention to the congregation. Thank you. I really appreciate that. <laughs> and I'll remember when you have a birthday, too. <laughs> we don't want to be guilty of idolatry. <laughs> anyway, we, we all love you and very, very much. And y'all mean a lot to us, the whole congregation. And, and, uh, and what you do for Israel. And what you guys do for Israel also gives Pat and I the opportunity to do stuff for them also, that normally we didn't know what to do with saying we give donations and stuff, but this is great and we love doing this, helping you guys. And this means a lot to us. Thank you, uh, love love you. Jewish people on my heart, especially. Uh, see, I didn't really know that much about the Jewish people until I married Pat, and I knew what they went through, but I couldn't figure out why. Because every morning we put God first, and we read his word, and we was reading in there why he punished the Jews like he did because they kept turning their back on him. And I said, you know, you figured to eventually learn, but when I watched Saul Sender, uh, Schindler's list, you know, it really touched me, you know, what they went through. So, you know, we went to the museum not too long ago, and that was really, uh, I really learned a lot from that. Mm -hmm. so. But anyway, I just want to say happy birthday. Thank you. We love you guys. And that uh, that song I sung with Barry, it's a number one hit now. Oh, so so. I figured it would We be. would like to sing it again. Before we sing it, we have five people with birthdays this month. We have, of course, Dr. Syde. We have Linda Allen. We mm -hmm. have Audra Clark. Yay. We have Mary Drake and we mm -hmm. have Jay Axtell. Wow. Happy birthday. <laughs> and also we got a lot of visitors tonight and I want to welcome you guys and thank you so much for coming. Amen. Oh, and he's going to go into the Marines. Yes. Sure. Jay Paul. Keep, uh, him in prayer also. He's yes. Leave tomorrow, I believe. Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah. Right, we'll be praying for him. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Jeff, Andre J. My little police heart flutter. Oh, oh, that is so dear. Oh my goodness. You're turning your lights on, honey. <laughs> you know he's going to like that, the cats. Thank you. That Thank is you. too cool. Officer size. 